bear and a cub. Yeah. I see both, Aww. and I think both got on the video. Are you on the line right now, Jonathan? All right, here we are at the Stony Man Trailhead where the Appalachian Trail crosses the, um, what is it? It's uh, Skyland. Uh, yes. There's a restaurant. We just ate breakfast at the restaurant. It was very nice. A little pricey, but it, it was nice. Had good views. We're going to go out the Appalachian Trail, going to head north to Little Stony Man, see if there's a puddle hanging out uh, on that. I see pictures of this cool puddle I want to take a picture of. Probably do the uh, Stony Man, grab that peak, and then go south and head out towards uh, the AT South and end up at the shelter down there. And it's really good parking, and it looks like the trail's paved here today. Well, not today. Oh, there's a backcountry sign. Back country. And this trail seems to be wicked used. So here's the intersection of where Stony Man goes up and the Appalachian Trail goes that way. We're going to go up to Little Stony Man where the Appalachian Trail is. Stony Man outlook. It's steep, steep cliffs. It's kind of cool. Are you on the line right now, Jonathan? Alright, here we are. Found the water that I was looking for. Alright, here we are at the water. We found it. And I'll drop a GPS coordinate on my map. It's not exactly where I thought it was going to be. It's further south. It's at the south end of the trail, right on the AT, right before the uh, switchbacks down. And it's evidently a very popular place for rappelling. We got a group, group right in front of me, and a group behind you too. doing some work. Oh, there's two groups. Cool. All right, this is the actual Stony Man, not the peak. The peak's a little, on a, not a spur trail. You have to bushwhack to the real peak on GPS, but this is the outcropping where the view is, and there seems to be one of these little mud puddles. And as you can see, a lot of people up here staring at the view. And then I'm guessing this peak Okay. Right there the is the peak that we're going to. Uh, and it's a beautiful place. I mean, Luxville, it's, you know, you're out there. Wherever it is. Know, nothing, you know. So here we are at the trail junction right near Skyland. There's a water t the tank right up the hill. And point one down that way is where the dining hall is. There's piped water, some water fountain spigots, and uh, food, bathrooms, all kind of stuff like that. According to this guy here, uh, somebody scribbled on it in pencil. It's seven tenths to where the stables are. So off we go, uh, continuing on the Appalachian Trail on the lower side of where that tank is, is where it goes.
With gnats. Yeah, with gnats. Oodles of gnats. <laughs> the longer we stand still, the more flies we get in our eyes. Blah. Blah, gnats. Blah. All right, this looks like the road crossing at the stables. And There's the stables. You see the stables. And there's a horse in the stables. And Where's the white, oh, there's the white blaze. There's the white blaze. There's this white blaze across the way. Somebody's stopping for us here. Across the road. I see a white blaze on the tree. And another one in here at the stables. Cool. Here's the Appalachian Trail smoker station. <laughs> And the uh, trail goes down that way, but look, We're still there, at is the stables. A, there is a feeding, no petting or teasing, and it looks like there's a soda machine up there. I'm going to check that out. Full of these little overlooks along the ridge. So, this little pipe spring is a couple hundred yards south on the Appalachian Trail by the Timber Hollow, Timber Hollow Parking Loop, which is right right up there and uh, ground's a little squishy that's kind of sad <laughs> hopefully what's at the shelter is not like that it's going to take a while to get some water <laughs> crossing. It says it's uh, 1.4. I lied. It's only 1.4. This spring is 0 0.1 this way, down right. the hill with some water. I'm going to check it out. Only because I have empty storage. I've got three liters of storage and if there's no water at the uh, at the hut I'll be sorry so I might as well just go down here. Fill her up. That is a short point one, or at least it was an easy point one with no pack. And that one's flowing good. So this here is a Virginia trail. And it's kind of dirt and flat. Kind of goes that way. In New Hampshire, in the whites, especially going up on Washington, that would be a New Hampshire trail. And uh, this does not go that way. Hey, bear, 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 bear. Saw him. Stop right at this junction. There he is. Can you see him on the camera? Oh, yeah. Okay, bear, go away, bear. <laughs> we got you now. <laughs> He's going the other way. All That's right, cool. so this is actually right at. Point one from the Rock Springs hut. Oh, thank goodness. So, and the cabin is point two, and the spring is point two, and the, the bear bear's over there. <laughs> is over there. <laughs> so, hopefully, the bear stays away while we're sleeping tonight. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, there is a bear and a cub. Yeah. I see both, Aww. and I think both got on the video. So, there were only two, and I hear no other footprints. No. So they'll be gone. Yeah. 
there's a wire. Hmm? There's this little wire. It just doesn't it won't work in there. For here. All right, so there's a there's a privy there. No. There's your shelter and the bear vault. Sweet. All right, just up on the hill here. There's a few of these tent sites. Some better than others. We're gonna scam this one here real quick. One down there, not so flat, a little lumpy. There's some more scattered, scattered up and about. This one seems to be flat and big enough. So we'll see if we can make it out. I'll run down and get the pack and uh, probably hit the whizzer before I do that. And oh, I guess the spring's in between the two huts. There's the actual cabin down there. All right, there's a little side trail. Comes down around from the hiker shelter. And there's a real deal cabin here. Spring cabin. You got the regular shelter right up there. The water's right down here. People keep talking about scooping. See how much is coming out of this. Oh, well, somebody smooshed the pipe is what's going on with that. The pipe has been discombobulated, but it is flowing. You can hear it really good in there. See if we can get the pipe working again. All right, this spring, the rock spring, shelter, not the best. It's flowing, it's still flowing good. It's clear, it's cold, but you either got a scoop and the pipe was all yanked out. Somebody had pulled the pipe out and hosed it up. There's a little spot way in the back where the water trickles down. So if you set the pipe in just right, it comes out. But it's it's really slow. Um, running but slow, so I'd suggest bringing a scoop for this one. sites that rock spring shelter they're just up the hill from the shelter and the rock spring shelters right down there Alright, looks like we are at the top of the service road. It says it's bird's nest number two. Appears to be a day shelter, picnic area. Yeah. D 
day use overnight prohibited. No camping within a hundred yards, no fires. And up this way appears to be the sum of fifty yards. Yep, no view here today. <laughs> <laughs>